Hey Trumpet fam, welcome back to another video. This is a super exciting one because the company that uh, makes the flugelhorn that I play, Carol Brass, sent me a package. Um, and I believe what's in here is a pocket trumpet, or I think on their side, it's a mini pocket trumpet. Basically a really tiny trumpet, which I've never played before, never owned one, so I'm super excited about that. Yeah, so let's just zoom in and let's start opening this. All right, here we are. Welcome to the floor. That you've never seen the floor before where I record. <laughs> All right, so let's just start with the opening and yeah, see what's inside. All right, here we go. Let's see, we got a box. We got things that make loud sound. All right, let's see, what do we have first? Let's zoom in on this box here. All right, so we got this here, which I'm gonna guess, well, it's either just a uh, carrying case or maybe the trumpet's inside. I guess we'll find out in a second. And we got a wool bag with a uh, valve oil. Always need more valve oil, you know, if you've ever seen my, uh, if you've seen the trumpet stereotypes video, don't be the valve oil guy, you know, come on. And then I think, let me see what else is in here. It looks like we've also got some, a little mouthpiece. I assume this is the mouthpiece that goes in the mini trumpet, but I guess we'll find out in a minute. Okay, so we got that, put that to the side. And we have this here. Oh, right, okay, so what this, they told me about this, this is called an anti-mute. So this actually goes in the end of the trumpet, or the end of the mini trumpet. And I think it kind of makes it sound more like a real trumpet. Because I guess mini trumpet, pocket trumpets have a slightly different sound. So if you use this, it'll actually give it kind of more of a full sound, uh, yeah, like a full trumpet. Uh, so yeah, we'll actually see what that does once we get the actual trumpet out. And then we have a lot of t-shirts. Huh, that's pretty cool. All right, let's zoom back out and uh, yeah, see, uh, pull this whole trumpet out. Okay, so now we pulled everything out of the box. Let's switch into the shirt real quick. Wow, magical. Here we go. We got Carol Brass right there. That's the company. <laughs> All right, and then uh, yeah, let's let's open this little trumpet. This is actually a really cool case. It's honestly like freaking tiny, which I guess is to be expected since the trumpet is also very tiny. Right. I'm zoom in here a little bit more. All right. So back here. All right, and let me know, we'll see what it looks like and just some basic uh, of what it sounds like. But I plan on making a bunch of videos with this. It's gonna be super fun play around with and it's easier to carry around obviously so yeah let me know in the comment section what I should do with this uh, little mini trumpet like what um, yeah what kind of videos should I make all right so <laughs> I'm opening I've opened the case here like this we have obviously this stuff as always and then we have our mini <laughs> trumpet here <laughs> oh my god it's so tiny and compact it's actually quite heavy honestly probably a similar weight to an actual trumpet, a full-size trumpet, except it's all condensed into this tiny little, uh, tiny little thing. So we have this case. It's actually a really good quality case from the looks of it. Just cushion on all sides, as you can see. The trumpet just whoo, sits in there, just like that, real nice and easy. Um, and then let me set this aside for a second so we can look at the case. And then we have on the front a little carrying pocket. What's in here? A strap? I assume this strap. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so this strap uh, will then hook onto this case here like this. So, <laughs> so that we can carry it like a little pouch. Okay. And then yeah, so that little pocket we can put valve oil in there or something like that by the looks of it. And then yeah, that's basically it. Very simple case, but cool for carrying the pocket trumpet, which is really all it's necessary for. Also, it comes in different colors from my understanding. I got the blue because blue is cool. We like blue. 
All right, so now what you've all been waiting for, I'm sure, which is the actual trumpet. Okay, so let's pull this out here. Oh my goodness, I don't even know how you're supposed to hold the pocket trumpet. Let's get a nice little look-see here. Yeah, pretty crazy looking, honestly. It's very small, there you go. We've got this little wrap here, I assume. I'm gonna make the assumption. Now I have a very, very small understanding of pocket trumpets and how they work, but that this is your tuning slide. Yeah, there we go. So what you're normally, you would put out your third finger for the D uh, or for uh, tuning, yeah, like a low D on a normal trumpet. Uh, I guess you use this one on this and I assume it's still for the D, but I'm really not sure. Yeah, so very compact. Here's the other angle at it. Really pretty though. Yeah, as I said, pretty hefty, honestly. Well, here's your, you got your little uh, spit valves right here. And then another one on the other side. All right, over here, you got the brand name, Carol Brass. Um, yeah, so let's, uh, let's put in a mouthpiece and try it out. I assume it probably fits a trumpet mouthpiece, which I will check right now. All right, the answer is yes. Here's my original trumpet mouthpiece that you can put in here. But uh, for now, just because we're gonna, we're just checking out what's in the actual package, we're gonna try out the um, mouthpiece that comes with it first, and then we can try it with this mouthpiece. All right, so the bag that we had before, we have this little plastic mouthpiece, and I'm actually really curious how this is gonna sound. I've never played on a plastic mouthpiece before. I've heard they're actually kind of nice, at least when you're playing outside because they don't get cold. Um, the sound I'm sure is a little bit different, so here we go. Just sticks in there like that. That's a pretty interesting look. Now let's get a feel for how it sounds, huh? actually sounds really good and the mouthpiece is really easy <laughs> to play on I don't know why if it's the plastic but I just feel like it's really easy to move my embouchure this is a totally honest review like they're not paying me to say any of this they just sent me the instrument like honestly I've never played on a plastic mouthpiece before and that's pretty interesting honestly I mean please let me know in the comments what you think it sounds pretty similar to a normal trumpet it's definitely a little bit different <laughs> finding it a little bit harder to play in the high range uh, on this mouthpiece but obviously it's not really meant for range playing specifically and I'm just used to my own mouthpiece so that's probably something you could get more adjusted to and also as I said you can put your own mouthpiece in there as well which I'm gonna do right now all right probably gonna sound the same <laughs> And I'll definitely make more videos in the future kind of comparing this to a real trumpet. I keep saying real trumpet, a full-size trumpet and other videos like this. Right now, I just want to get a basic sense of kind of how it sounds. Now, let's put this uh, anti-mute in there and see kind of how that changes the sound. I'd honestly never even heard of this before. So it just kind of goes in the end like this. I think it just makes the bell wider. I'm assuming this is probably the same size as the bell of a normal trumpet. Yeah, so with the mute in there, that's what it looks like. It's like it's got a double bell. That's pretty interesting. Right, you guys tell me what you think in the comments down below. I'm not sure if I can tell just by listening with my ears. I'd probably have to record it to tell better um, exactly what the difference is uh, having the anti-mute on there. But my assumption is if I recorded it, you could probably tell the difference more uh, just with a wider tone and all that kind of thing. With that being said, I think that's going to be the end of the unboxing. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this uh, really interesting. Thanks again to Carol Brass for sending me this over. Um, I've always wanted to try out a pocket trumpet and I'm actually super excited to make a ton of videos with this thing in the future. It's super compact and very easy to uh, carry around. It's also a pretty reasonable price. 
Um, I'm pretty sure these things are only about $200, which is obviously way cheaper than a normal trumpet. And the quality seems pretty great to me. Um, obviously, I'll figure that out more as I play. Um, as I play the instrument more, if you want to check one of these out, um, also their flugelhorns and trumpets, they actually give you a discount if you tell them that I sent you. So if you go to the information down below, uh, you can go check out their products and also get a discount um, on those. Um, as I said though, they did not pay me to say anything I did in this video. This is really my real reaction to this um, and yeah, just how I'm experiencing it firsthand. With that being said, Please leave a like rating if you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys all in the next one.